happy full moon everyone and of course it is in the sign of Aries oh that fire energy <clears throat> full moons are all about endings finalizing things wrapping things up getting projects finished so look at your life and what areas need to be wrapped up what things need to be finished up what's left undone is there a relationship in your life that hasn't been completely nipped in the bud that uh, has unfinished business it's time to finish it up is there projects that you've been working on that okay now you need to just dig in deep and finish that project full moon energy lasts two or three days before the day of and two or three days after the full moon so you have this whole week to finish things up but when you finish projects and finish things they usually end up being done done like I, that's it you don't have to go back and keep retouching it again and again and again so relationships that are ended on a full moon usually are done completely done think about that pay attention to those moon cycles because if you're done with a relationship and you want it to be finished completed ended completely but it's something that's kind of you know is going to come back and forth back and forth or the other person is try finishing it on a full moon see what happens just gonna say <laughs> so it's that time everyone Aries energy, like I said yesterday, is going to cause triggers. So be paying attention. Be aware of what's triggering you and why. Start dealing with those parts of your life that still need healing. And let's get things done. We are, after all, out of retrograde. Thank goodness. Have a great day, everyone. And remember, you have the power to create the life you've always dreamed of. Yes, you do. Get outside, touch the earth, cleanse your space, do your meditations. And remember this, Wyatt, a wolf, the raven, and spirit, we're sending you unconditional love. Mwah.